Who is Ross Lovegrove? I'm known as a designer, but I wish there was a different definition. Designer has become desiccated in its meaning. I'm trying to counter the temporal nature of product design with the permanence of art. Who are your influences? The great sculptors are the ones that my mind always goes to. And if I'd have lived in the past, I would have begged, stolen, or borrowed to be an assistant of Bernini, or to be a fly on the wall in Rodin's studio, or Brancusi. What is organic essentialism? Organic meaning the way one thinks, but also often the material that one uses and the resulting form, and essential being nothing more or nothing less than you need. How do materials influence your designs? If you come back to the great sculptors, they would always talk about the truth to material. It's the idea of walking around an object, staring at it, and revealing something artificial out of something natural. With Ginkgo, I wanted to try something that I had in my mind for a long time, which is single surface deformation. So you take a skin and you deform it, and through the deformation process, you create rigidity. So you get artificial creasing strategies, and the creasing will make that cantilever. So that's how you cantilever out. How do you collect design? I'm different because I'm a designer, so I collect things with meaning. I collect tribal shields, and what's great about the shields is the fact that they correspond to your body, so they're an external element, they're like a prosthetic. I wouldn't buy anything that I could buy a, a derivation of in cheap plastic. I would buy something that was close to the man, the maker. Design can change your psyche, because design is really something which is a measure of our progress or our demise.